guys a very good evening i hope your exam went really well um overall i felt the exam was e easy even though i could not get a lot of feedback from the students because in my at my center it was a small center hardly 20 25 students were there so i could not get a detailed feedback i will be making a live class um on an academy at 8 o'clock for which i'll give you the link down in the description box it's a free class where i'll also be solving the questions that came up in the today's examination um so you can enroll for the class and to unlock that class you need to use the code sethi that is city coming on to the examination the initial impressions if i talk about um it was easy definitely no doubt about it physical chemistry was very different um this was the first time i could say that there was only one question from quantum that that was on acceptable wave function i could not see any other questions so there was no question from statistical thermodynamics and even the questions that were asked if you see vapor pressure um there the, uh, there were a couple of questions on vapor pressure enthalpy so all of those questions uh, it felt like uh, i was giving up examination for iit je rather than um you know for a um, uh, masters level examination it in terms of physical chemistry spectroscopy was there as as, as expected um the nmr spectroscopy questions were quite simple and even the general spectroscopy questions that were asked um were quite straight forward and to the point um so overall i think it was a easy examination no doubt about that the cut off is going to go high um i can i can say that it will be beyond 30 according to me um rest like i said i'll be making a detailed video really soon and it is going to be a live class so we can have a discussion over there as well um and uh, coming back to the msq based questions uh, they were quite disappointing not that they were easy or difficult not disappointing in that perspective but the kind of questions that were asked like there was one msq question on actinides um then there was one question whether potassium inside the um, animal cell is found to be greater or outside uh so the kind of questions the level of the questions that were there in msq again not the level but the kind of questions were not very satisfactory they were very disappointing i think you can ask a lot of conceptual questions based on in msq based questions which uh, i could not see in the examination the organic part quite easy inorganic was also straightforward organic was uh, was quite easy um in fact a lot of questions directly came from whatever i have been teaching on unacademy plus i will also be providing some screenshots of exact same questions that we had discussed at least 5 to 6 same questions from organic chemistry um came in the examination as expected zero chemistry had a lot of weightage um that was something that was expected there was questions from sulfoxide elimination um then a water reaction you know and uh, then there was question from uh, this uh, protecting group that uh, diethylene group they have asked a lot uh then diethylene followed by sulfoxide elimination right uh then there was one on zero isomerism that was expected any t type question that was definitely going to come no there was no doubt about it um and what what all other questions were there in organic chemistry uh, yeah evans auxiliary there was a question on evans auxiliary where you basically uh, like the phenyl the benzyl group will attack get attached below the plane and then you are lithium aluminum hydride and then it will convert into the alcohol to summarize i would say organic chemistry was quite easy uh inorganic as well was um you know it was achievable you could do a lot of questions from inorganic chemistry uh physical chemistry i did not personally find it lengthy uh but the questions that were asked if were quite basic like you know there were a lot of questions from your uh de de broglie wavelength uh then you know the quantum the atomic structure not the quantum chemistry but the atomic structure so there were a lot of questions from that uh then there was question on voltage what so there it was more application based question there was a question from your um, efficiency as well calculate the efficiency so the questions were quite basic but maybe the students might not have prepared like beer lambert's law also was there so there were questions they were straight forward they were easy but it's just that maybe the students might not have prepared because of which they might lose out on marks so uh for this particular exam especially in physical chemistry if your foundations are strong you could have done really well okay if your foundations were really strong in physical chemistry you would have done excellent um physical chemistry was some way midway organic was definitely easy if one has prepared or one is preparing for csi net they would have found this exam to be very easy the organic section and in in organic like i said was also doable so overall uh, the exam was easy and i feel that the cut off will go high let me know what your opinions are down in the comment section and also we will be having a detailed discussion about the answer key and also about the question paper uh, at 7:30 pm on an academy for which the link is down in the description box okay thank you so much for watching um i'll see you in the next video really soon i'm teaching live on the an academy platform in the csir ugc net category where i'm taking both the free classes as well as the paid courses so if you want to get access to the free classes all you have to do is download the an academy app 
and when joining the CSR UGC net category you have to use the unlock code that is SETHI this is absolutely free of cost and you will get access to all my classes while if you want to take the paid subscription or the plus subscription there is a subscription fee for that and if you want some discount on the subscription fee you can use the referral code SETHI this will give you 10% discount on top of that you will also get access to the my whatsapp group where I frequently post a lot of updates related to exams and other things in addition with the plus subscription what all benefits you are going to get well you can watch all my sessions apart from that you can watch other sessions that are um, available from other educators in the CSR UGC net category you will also get a frequent mock test for the examination for your practice and some doubt solving sessions as well so if you're interested in joining the plus platform you can definitely check out the free classes first and then take a decision to take the plus classes do not forget to use these referral codes uh, this will give you a discount for the plus subscription and this code you have to use when you're joining the app to get access to all my free classes.